Hello friends and welcome to another video of Travel Tech. Now in this video I am going to show you how you can download and install the Spotify music app for Digipad. Now I had already shown you previously about a few months back that how you can download and install Spotify but currently as I have been getting some reports from my users that the link is not working properly and also that the particular website which I had given a link for might be containing a malware. So just in case, just to make sure that you get a safe installation without any malware into your Digipad, I am bringing up a new video with a new updated link for the Spotify app which you can easily download on your Digipad and install it conveniently. So let's just go ahead and install the Spotify app on your Digipad. So before I begin uh, showing you how you can download the Spotify app, make sure your Digipad is connected to the internet using a Wi-Fi dongle. And in case you don't have a Wi-Fi dongle, I'll leave a link in the description for you to buy it. And once your Digipad is connected to the internet, make sure you have enabled the installation of apps from unknown sources. I have put in detail regarding that in many of my previous videos. So just go back and check that in case you don't know how, you to, how to enable the installation of apps from unknown sources as well. So once that is done, the next thing which you need to do is install the Firefox browser which you are seeing right here. So in case you haven't installed Firefox browser also, I'll leave a link in the description and you'll get to know how you can download and install the Firefox browser on your Digipad. So once these three things are done away with, you can go ahead and download the new Spotify app for your Digipad and start listening to music on the go. So let's just go ahead and click on the Firefox browser and wait for the web page to load up. So once the home screen does load up, just click on the URL search bar and type in the address which I'm going to show you right now and that is B I T dot L Y slash T R A V E L T E C H S P O T I F Y that is travel tech spotify so this is the url address guys that is bit.ly slash travel tech spotify so once you type in this address just press on the go button and wait for the google drive page to load up on the digipad screen so as you can see the google drive page has loaded up and if you can see uh, on top of the screen it's written as spotify by travel tech so once this open up just press on the download button in the middle of the screen so that the download begins immediately so now the download has started and it is showing the download progress and the notification bar. You can drag down the notification bar from top of the screen and get to know the current status of the download. The app is about 13.5 MB in size and it may take a minute or two to download on the Digipad depending on the speed of your connection. So just be patient for a while and once the app downloads, I'll show you how you can install it as well. So now the download complete dialog box is showing up as the download has completed. So once that gets completed, you just have to click on this download complete dialog box and wait for the installation window to open up. And here you go. Here is a Spotify installation screen on the screen right now on the Digipad screen. So let's just go ahead and click on the install button and wait for the Spotify app to install itself. Now the application has installed. So once as it gets installed, you just go ahead and click on the open button. So once you open it and when you open it for the first time the app is going to open up in a portrait mode as you're seeing on the screen right now and it's not going to open in a landscape mode. So this is a very temporary problem and it can be solved very easily. So don't worry in case if, if it opens in a portrait mode you just have to go ahead and click on the login button right here. So if you just click on the login button so there you go you have to enter the username password of your uh, Spotify account. So just go ahead and enter the username and password. So right now I am entering my username and password of the Spotify account. So once you enter that you will get an access to the landscape mode as well. So let me just go ahead and get access into my Spotify account. So I just entered my username and password and I have logged in onto my Spotify account. So as you can see the Spotify menu is opening up right here. So let's just head back to the home screen. So once your home screen is reached just press on the home button once and then go ahead and click on the app section once again. So once the app section is open up just scroll down and here you can see the Spotify app. So just click on the Spotify app next time. 
and here you go the spotify app has opened up in a landscape mode and the portrait mode has gone away so you just need to log in into your spotify account and once you log in into your spotify account you can get access to your account using a landscape mode and it will be properly working in the digipad as well so that is one of the nice things about this spotify app so once the spotify app does open up you can get access to your collections to your private Spotify collections whichever you have saved in your uh, Spotify account and that will be working immediately and you can start listening to music right and then and there away. So once you install the Spotify app on your Digipad you can go ahead and get it on the home screen. Just press and hold on the app icon on the on your app section and drag it down to the home screen so that you can access it easily and conveniently. So this is how guys you can download and install the Spotify app on your Digipad and in case the direct download on the Firefox is not working for you and if you are getting a parsing error I have already shown how you can avoid the parsing error by downloading the app directly on the laptop or your smartphone so I'll leave a link for that also in the description and in case you are getting a parsing error you can go ahead and watch that video and get to know how you can download from the laptop and side load it onto the Digipad easily so this is the way guys this is the method you can get Spotify on your Digipad and you can start listening to music start enjoying music on the go just make sure your Digipad is connected to the internet and you have a world of music on your hands so that's it guys i hope you like this video and if you did make sure you hit that subscribe button and also like this video before going away this is travel tech signing off and have a really nice day